Welcome back to Business Access. What does it take to plan an event? How do you take a venue and change it from this to this? I talk with Leighton Davis, expert event planner at Creative Media and Events, to talk about the growing industry of event planning in Jamaica. Let's take a look. My name is Leighton Davis, Managing Director at Creative Media and Events Limited. Hi Mr. Davis, thanks for sitting and chatting with us. I'm really excited to delve into the details of the event planning industry. So let's just get started. I would love to know how you got started in this industry. Rather, how long have you been in the event planning industry? I've been planning events from I was a teenager. Um, 15 years now. I always had a passion for letting persons enjoy themselves and that passion took me into keeping events on a professional level, which of course has now spiraled into me opening Creative Media and Events. At Creative Media and Events, we are a team of professional event planners. We conceptualize for our clients, um, we meet the clients to find out what their needs are, and then we execute. We bring all the suppliers together to create the perfect event. That's what Creative Media Event does. This is where we have done a setup for the Flow 5th anniversary. We have done events here for other clients, but we wanted to do something different. Right. So this time what we did is that we had persons enter through the house. The concept was actually um, showcasing, of course, flow, you know, it's technology. So we're showcasing yeah. technology from back then to present. Yeah. And so we thought coming through the front of the house, the Devon house, would mean that obviously we'd be able to showcase um, back in the early 1800s. Telephones. With the, the, exactly. So yeah. we, we rented um, those type of technology to showcase that. And then, of course, as they open the doors here, people would just walk into the future. There are quite a bit of event planners out there. A lot of companies offer this service, but what would set an event planner apart from the rest? Well, what sets us apart is thoughtful, meticulous planning and clinical execution. And what I mean by that is that you need to work with a company that has accountability. Because it's very easy for a person to say that they're an event planner and you know that's good and well but what if something goes wrong you know there there's there's some attention to details that need to be accounted for you know has insurance been put in place you know um, is there something there to protect if one of your um, guests should be injured at the event and also to be able to think ahead in terms of having connections with the the right authorities in terms of getting your permits and to put things in place in terms of getting your supplies and thing to ensure the success of your event. The event planning industry is huge. Um, around the world, it's something that is just very big. It, it, it affects a lot of persons because obviously for you to have any successful event that you've been to, look at the Olympics, for example, an event planner had to plan that um, from start to finish. Um, the same thing with any other sporting event. There are event planners that are involved with concerts, you know, the jazz and blues, all these things that happen that you see happen that you go to an experience. Um, you might enjoy yourself, but do you think about what goes behind it? An event planner starting months in advance, putting all the things together. And so it is a huge industry. What has to happen is that we need persons to have more respect for event planners. If you're feeling sick and your tooth is hurting you, you're not going to get a wrench and take it out, you're going to go to a dentist. And so if you want to have an event planned properly, you need to go to a professional. Not someone who just says that they're an event planner, but somebody who actually has experience, works with good suppliers, and has your best interest at heart. So without mentioning any names, are you able to hone in on a specific experience that you could share, even from when you were a teenager or just getting started mm. in the party planning? You know. Yes, I remember um, in my party heyday, keeping the high society events, there was one particular event that the weather came into play. We planned this event, millions of dollars were spent, and I was at the event by myself, my other business partners called and said, you have to make the call. 
should we postpone, knowing that postponing the event would cost us a lot of money. And I looked, I really did not want to postpone, but when I saw that the waiters and the suppliers who were carrying stuff into the event were slipping in mud, we called it off and I can tell you, I didn't sleep well that night. I, did, I don't think I slept at all. Um, we lost a lot of money, but we turned the negative into positive. We took all the food that was to be supplied for thousands of persons and we gave it away to some children's homes um, in Kingston. And I believe that God blessed us because of that, because the event came off three days later and it was more successful than we even imagined or thought it would have been. So what makes it fun and interesting? What excites you the most about this industry? What makes it exciting? I love to be in the background, right? I love to see a happy client. I love to see when persons come to an event and they're wowed and they're, they're like, how do you think about this? Or how did, you, how did, how did that come about? Um, the ultimate goal for me at the end of the day is not money because you cannot be driven by money because money will come and go. But if your clients are happy, then it makes us happy. For more information on planning your next event, contact Creative Media and Events at 754-2075.